there, how are you guys? Happy whatever day it is, I don't even know. <laughs> so here's today's challenge for you guys today. Number one, find out what day it is. I don't, I don't know, but do that. So there you go, we'll start with that. But um, how many of you guys woke up today and you just were like, I've had it, I, I'm done, I'm tired, I'm frustrated. I am just ready to go back to normal. I'm ready for my kids to be back in school. I'm ready for my spouse to be back at work. I'm ready to be back at work myself. Um, I'm, you know, how many of you woke up that way? Maybe you've been feeling that way for a long time. Maybe this has been really, really hard for you. And maybe some of you are finally hitting that point right now. So here's what I, um, you know, when I sat down and, and I just was like, okay, God, what do you want us to share today for the challenge? And um, what's what's on your heart for us to bring uh, to everyone today? And and then I read this, and here was the scripture I read today. It says in John 16, 33, I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. <sighs> what an incredible thing. That in the middle of the chaos, in the middle of all that is going on, God is our peace. He's our refuge. He's our shelter. He's everything that we need if we just call on him. It says he freely gives us peace. And so in the middle of the frustration, in the middle of the chaos, in the middle of feeling like you're going to explode, we can remember that God's word says, I give you peace. You know, a volcano is formed by two areas of the earth rubbing together and it causes the magma, which then causes an explosion. The more it rubs, the bigger the explosion. When we went to Hawaii, we were able to take a helicopter ride and fly over the island of Kauai and uh, we actually got to see um, a volcano. Now it's gorgeous from the air, simply gorgeous. But what's happening underneath it is a whole different story. So my question to you today is what's happening in your heart? What's happening underneath where no one can see it? Is that rubbing starting to build? Are you starting to get to a breaking point where you are ready to explode? I'll be honest, I felt that way this morning. And then I read this, that God will give us the peace that we need. So today's challenge is look at your heart. Look at what's happening under the surface. Are you becoming an, a volcano? Are you ready to explode? And if so, what do you need to do to calm down? What is it that you need to do to refocus and put things in a perspective? You know, we're home and that could be hard and challenging, but we are safe. We're home, and again, hard and challenging, but we get to make memories with our, our family, with our spouse. We're home, we get to work on ourselves and see what God's doing inside of us. So let's take this time today to just look deep at our heart. What's going on inside? And where do we need to calm down? And where do we need God's peace to come in and give us rest? So your challenge today is just to look within, to stop the volcano from erupting and to find peace in Christ because he gives it so freely. So we hope you have an incredible day. Stay safe. Side note, for any of our essential workers who are watching this, who are out on the front lines um, day in and day out, we wanna say thank you. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for going to work every day, even in the middle of all that's going on. We are so grateful for each and every one of you, for the hard work, the dedication, and your heart being poured into all that you're doing. We pray that you stay safe and healthy. And again, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We hope you guys have an incredible day. Stay safe and we'll see you tomorrow.